Happy Saturday. Talked a little bit about this yesterday. It takes an, it takes an immense amount of courage to look at oneself and, and want to change. And the grand illusion is that we're all terminally unique and nobody's going to get you and if I tell this person or that person how I truly feel that maybe they'll laugh and maybe they will but if we isolate you know just if you never open up about what's going on with you then no one will know that echo chamber of voices within our heads will never hear anything different. You can't think you're out of ins you can't think your way out of an insane thought. You've got to, you know, ask for <laughs> you don't have to, but you get to ask for a different perspective to help adjust our thinking. It takes a lot of courage to be able to do that. It takes a lot of courage to open your heart and expose what you're afraid of, to be vulnerable. But the key to vulnerability, or the key to intimacy, is vulnerability. You're never going to be intimate with anybody if you're never vulnerable. And I think it speaks to a larger portion of ourselves, or a larger portion of the civilization that we live in, that we're terrified to be vulnerable. The illusion of intimacy, that if I text you, you'll know what's going on. The communication, we have so many ways to continue to communicate, and we are, yet our intimacy is being, on some levels, being diminished. It's, at, it's each of our responsibilities to, to connect if you want. I mean, if you don't, fine, but... I don't know. I think it's imperative. It's important for me to continue to connect with my peers and my community, to stay current, and for lack of a better term, like tell on myself for the secrets that I think nobody cares about or that make me unlovable. Because that is an illusion that I'm unlovable, that, that, that any of us are unlovable. The grand illusion is that we're separate. That what I do does not affect you. That's, I think, <laughs> it seems, you know, statistically that that's not true. I cut down a bunch of trees and I'm going to affect other people, you know, um, on a macro or micro level. It all affects, we all affect each other. I don't know. Have a happy Saturday. Much love.